don't know if I'm not careful that thing gets in the shot. Okay. Okay, so I've got queso, and I just, oh, look what I found. Another phone case. Uh, you see what's, you know, you see how I am. I probably bought it and said, oh, that, I don't have that phone anymore. So it's brand new, but, but I also, I found the box. I was like, oh, what's this? It was in the box. <laughs> I don't even have that phone anymore. It's never been used. All right, so, I'm, but I'm going to put the box. Yeah, that would be reasonable. I'm going to try to put bigger stuff. So I've got my basket. And I, I don't think you want to put anything that rolls on the ground. I can try putting something really far away. He's going to really have to travel. soda can in here because it's not going to roll away. You really don't want stuff that's going to roll away. And the clip. That'll be on the old fall. I can try putting the clip in here though. That would be reasonable. That would be something that would happen. Okay. And then the other phone. I could put the phone. I could put the phone on the top but I'll put it in the back this time. It's still a little bit hanging over. And the Anyway, he's going to come barreling out. Oh, hi, Linnea. Oh, with all this. Oh, no, it's awful, girl. It's, somebody doesn't upload this many videos and not have problems in other. I told you about the jeans thing. Oh, no, I buy those Trinity Ranch jeans, too. And I just, I buy the same ones over and over, not realizing. Yeah, I thought that, I think those are cute. I thought they were cute before. That's why I bought them before. So now I have some that I just save for. In case company comes, they've never been worn and don't have any possible dog prints on them. <laughs> They're still at the back. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, hang on. I had to travel right away, so he, didn't, he was going to throw that down and find something better. Yay! That was the key. I was running. I was running. Thank you. 
that was my very subtle recall. And it's gotta be subtle too. But you can get that box though, wait and see. I think they figure out how to turn stuff and stuff. <laughs> oh, he got it by the little handle. He's so clever. Okay, there's a phone way down there. OMG. Yay! It's like we both kind of thought of it at the seat. Be careful, my goodness. Oh, be careful. Um. Oh, okay, the, there's the phone in the back. That helped. I needed the basket to put the stuff in. All right, there's a phone on top of the doghouse, but it's in the back. Oh, he's doing his little break. You know, and I mean... No, he's already running around the cone. Y'all, he's on it now. And there really isn't any wind today. My job is just to face that direction. And I did. I made it where it was sticking out. Yay. <laughs> okay, so there's one more thing, and it's in the wagon. Oh, not that silly. But it's in that little cup holder thing. So he's going to have to go in there and look because you can't see it. But I think I can get him to go in there and look. But yeah, no, remember the other day, oh, uh, yeah, yesterday when I was making Crash pick up that box? Or I should say she was picking it up. And then later I put it in the house, and then of course Shoe Bottom knocked it on the floor. Uh, and then Queso picked it up, started picking it up, carrying it. have more faith in me. Now he thinks I'm an idiot. Ah! No, he's almost on it. He's on it. If I can get him in there. I hope you guys are still there. If he would go in there and look... did that to make it like a noise. I didn't want him to see me doing that. Uh, he's on it now. Okay, he got it. <laughs> oh, he'll always look in there from now on. Probably. All right, hang on. Yes, whoops. Oh, you probably couldn't see that. Darn it. Sorry. That is the caveat of this training. Hi, Morris. Uh, yeah, that's the caveat. Yeah, I'm just so excited I got another new phone to pick up. Everyone's like, who cares? Um, he believes he can do it, though. And he's got the good default. He's ready to travel. That's what just gets me about him. And the reason I just got those good pictures of the other one was that's their default is going up there. My job is to go, oh, it's, oh, sh I'm trying to feed him a plastic bag. All right, hang on. I think that's what you guys need to start doing at home. If the dog organically goes up there without saying anything, you know what I mean? If you went out in public and sat on a bench and somebody just walked up and handed you ten dollars and then left, you know, that's what he's saying. He's, gonna, he's trying to make it bigger, though, already. 
and I'm, I'm not going to do anything. There's got to be times where you do nothing, because that's what's making him think. As soon as he goes back over there, I'm going to be right there. And you've got to, if you're going to have any control over dog, honestly, if you're a trainer, you're thinking right off the bat, I've got to start adding distance of the dog away from the handler, or you understand that there's only so many things the dog can do right next to the handler. So... This is just good for that. It's good for the behavior of getting the dog to move away from the handler. Tell you little monkey, don't you dare knock that down. And I mean, there is, I mean, you do. I understand now that, uh, you know, the lack of velocity in your training is gonna be disastrous. If you don't have any velocity, and if you said why, because the things that are going to happen that you don't want the job are going to happen real fast. All right, he's all, he's got all. He understands, and this is, if you said what's his internal dialogue. That's where it's going, I'll get there first. That's where it's going, I'll get there first. It's not, it's telling me to go over there. I'm not telling you to do anything. The, it's, I, and I'm very clear, I'm not going to act like I'm going over there and go, trick ya, you know. Oh, you're going to be gamble. Okay, so I can just do the travel thing, and I'm just going to do the one little phone, and this, this one's probably the best, just because they can pick it up. It's got the soft. I know, already know he'll travel. I don't think he gets up on the thing. We can try. Yeah. So I rewarded him for jumping up. He just happened to fall on that thing. Oh, that's what this can be, the jumping, the jumping post. You're not some killjoy. Yay! So I just rewarded him for jumping. He's not jumping on me. If he jumps by that thing, it'll be better. Money she's at the office. He's trying to think of something to do. Yay! So I rewarded him for jumping. All right, so I've got my thing. I've got the little, it does have a little handle. They seem to be able to pick it up, though. All right, I'm just traveling, but then I, okay, he didn't see a drop, but let me see if I can send him back for it. instant reaction <laughs> and if you said why it, I, I realize that it's because it's soft it's not gonna make as much noise I should probably put a bell on it okay he's right he's looking for it now though he's looking for it so we just go to the green thing anything that happens over here Yay! the slightest jump if it moves its foot it gets a reward he'll jump again watch I'm just, <laughs> okay, so here we go. He's going to see it drop this time. Oh, he's like the Pony Express. And anyway, I've got an immediate, I've got an immediate impulse thing. If you said, well, it looks like you're kind of duplicating the videos where they all come running at once, where they all start turning. Yeah, I, I think you are doing that because you're trying to kick that behavior into gear. If you said, what wouldn't be good to do? Go, gimme, gimme, gimme. <laughs> gimme. So now I'm just rewarding for being on the platform. And I'm watching, I'm watching. That's why you guys have to tape your footage though. You're gonna look back and say, oh, I see now he was sitting over there and I didn't even notice. How awful. Now I don't want him to sit. I just like that he's over there. You have to think at the beginning. Ah! Oh! The beginning, you're just rewarding going there. You know, you're getting awards for attendance. 
Yeah, that's what you have to think of. Just attendance. You know, he's got perfect attendance. All right, as soon as he gets up there, bam. It's almost like magic. As soon as you go up there, it, it appears. Because you do, you've got to be, you know, apparently these people that do the, uh, the e-collar wrong, they, they have something called the Velcro dog. And if you said, well, how, what's the, it's an out of balance dog that's only been not driven towards the handler. I'm not going to say it was driven towards the handler. It, it was punished for leaving the handler. And so now it doesn't leave the handler. If you said, well, what if it was driven to the handler? What would, they'd go real fast. It'd go real fast. All right, one more time. So I'm just kind of walking, it's dangling. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. All right, the tape came off. Yay. He's probably going to go back and get the piece of tape. I wouldn't be surprised. This dog looks so much like Nilla. But I do have the collar on him. If I ignore him, he'll probably go get that piece of tape. But I'm going to tell you, I, because I've been doing this, I've got to work this weekend. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I knew you would go get that tape as soon as I didn't watch him. That's why, that's why I acted real quick right there. Um, I saw it through the screen. I'm going to work this weekend on my... Um, as if by magic it appears over there. You know, and I think anybody would agree with that statement. All right, now I'm watching him. As soon as he goes back up there, I'm going to go over there. He's just looking for something to find. He found that tape. He could find a stick. Oh, and he will, too. Um, you know, that's what you have to think of. There's three basic behaviors in dog training. Come to the handler, move away from the handler, or remain stationary, either by the handler or away from the handler. If you said, I'll show you all kinds of exercises where it's none of those things, there aren't any. That's, that's the limit. I mean, everything falls under the umbrella of those three behaviors. It's true. You know, in the order that you teach them in. Yeah, it's going to make a big difference. Anyway, guys, I'm going to be back. i got to tag Christopher in this video. Christopher's like, no. Uh, I'm going to try my Dobie gymnast slash high jumper. <laughs> I'll be right back.